Hello and welcome to Joss Event Online Weekend News. I am an infant. It's Mahil Forst, the news headlines. Shatima seeks international cooperation to combat global challenges. Akwabio dismisses reports of imminent NAS leadership change. Third government to improve railway workers' welfare. NIS to commence 24,000 passports daily production soon. Fed government moves to end illegal migration, human trafficking. 9,093 children suffered violation in five years, UNICEF says. NACDC police in New Park to protect FCT. Now the news in details. Vice President Kashim Shetima has emphasized the need for international cooperation towards combating global challenges. The Director of Information Office of the Vice President, Mr. Olushola Abiola, in a statement said, Shetima stated is well addressing world leaders at the ongoing G77 plus China leaders summit in Cuba. Shatima also spoke to an assembly of heads of state and government, the UN Secretary General, Antonio Gutes, and delegates, and delegates from over 100 countries from the global south. The President of Senate, Senator Godswill Akabio, has said the Senate under his leadership is stable, harmonious, and working towards a greater and better Nigeria. Apabio also boasted that the 10th Senate cannot be distracted by what it described as the innuendo of the merchants of political brush by what it appears to be a syndicated media attack from outside the precinct of the National Assembly. The federal government, through the Ministry of Transportation, has reviewed plans to improve the welfare of the staff of the Nigerian Railway Corporation and to foster better working condition. Minister of Transportation Saidu Alkali, who made the disclosure recently during a familiarization visit to the NRC's headquarters in Butimeta, Lagos, affirmed that it would give priority attention to the implementation of the presidential approval for the upward review of special allowance for Nigerian railway workers. The federal government has said once the backlog of passport applications have been cleared, the Nigerian Immigration Service will commence the production of 24,000 passports. Delhi, Minister of Interior Olubumi Tunji Ojo disclosed this in Abuja on Friday when a delegation from the United Nations Office on Drugs and Crimes visited his office. The federal government has called for interministerial collaboration to address illegal migration and human trafficking. Dr. Beta Edu, Minister of Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Alleviation, made the call when she paid a courtesy visit to the Minister of Interior, Mr. Olubumi Tunji Ocho, in his office. No fewer than 9,093 Nigerian children were gravely violated between 2017 and 2021. A new United Nations Students Fund report has revealed the story titled The Economic Cost of Conflict in Northeast Nigeria noted that conflict had negatively impacted the country's children and gross domestic products per capita. The Nigeria Security and Civil Defense Corps, NACDC, and the Nigerian Police Force has again pledged to work together to rid the federal capital territory of crime and criminality. FCT Commandant NACDC Olushola Odumosu revealed that the two agencies will continue to maintain cordial relationship while joining forces to provide adequate security for residents of the FCT and environs.
We have come to the end of the news at nine. Here's a recap of the story. Shetty Massing's international cooperation to combat global challenges. Akwabio dismisses reports of imminent NAS leadership change. The government to improve railway workers' welfare. NIS to commence 24,000 passport daily production soon. Federal government moves to end illegal migration, human trafficking. 9,903 children suffered violation in five years, UNICEF says. And see this see police in New Park to protect NCT. Thank you for watching Just Event Online News. Remember, what is worth doing is worth doing well. For more news, visit www.justeventonline.com and to read more updates. Follow us on our social media platforms with a tab at Just Event Online. You can also send us an email on Just Event Online at gmail.com. I am an infartist. You have a good night rest.